How's it going everyone? It's DJ and welcome back to another Skyblock video. And today I'm going to be sharing with you guys one simple method to make millions of coins in early game. I wish I'd known about this in, in when I was in early game. Although it might not have been around when I was in early game because it's recently just become more effective because of some recent rise in price and stuff. Uh, I believe at least. Or I was just too stupid to know about early game. That is quite possible. Uh, but either way, I figured I'd share it with you guys because I figured some of you guys will definitely enjoy this. You early game players will definitely enjoy this. It's so easy. It's so simple, and you can make so much money in early game, and maybe mid game as well, like early mid game. I'd say uh, it's not going to be as it's not going to make you as much, give you as much as you need. But with early game, it's definitely going to give you a great start. Or if you're starting a new profile as well. But real quick before we get into that, I feel like it's necessary to mention that over 95% of you guys aren't subscribed. So if you aren't already, please hit that subscribe button because I'm trying to get to 30,000 somewhat soon for YouTube rank. And also, I should really, really quick mention that when we hit 8,500 subscribers, I'm going to be doing a Skywar stream with viewers. So let's try and get there real soon. Anyways, without further ado, you don't want to hear me talk about this and stuff. Let's just get right into the video. Alright, so basically the single money th making method I'm going to tell you for this video for early game is literally Jacob's Contests. Now, that I've, I I kind of made a video in Jacob's Contest before on how to get a certain math hoe blueprint. Uh which is a very common item a lot of people like to get. Uh, and this is kind of pretty much the same thing, but there are some changes now after the new update with uh, with player drops. So I'm going to be kind of incorporating that into this and also talking more on the money side of this. So it's going to be a similar video, that last one, but it's going to be a little different. So now I'll real quick explain what Jacob's contests are for no people who don't know. Every three days, there are farming contests where essentially for uh, every three days, there'll be a farming contest for three kinds of crops. And basically, the more for, the more crops you farm, the higher you place, the more money you get. Basically, you don't actually get money, but you get a certain item called Jacob's tickets, which you can sell to the bazaar for twelve thousand each. And you do get a fair amount of them for um, for each contest that you do. Uh, so basically, it it, it ranks you uh, on, in three ca in into three uh, in, in into, into three tiers. Well, there's four technically because there's no tier, which is if you're just in the if you just don't get a tier at all. Then there's bronze, silver, and gold. Bronze is if you're in the top 60%, silver is top 25%, and gold is top 5%. Now for this video, you're literally just gonna, or for this tutorial, you're literally just gonna need to get bronze or silver. You don't need to worry about gold. Uh, because the Jacob's Contest you're gonna be looking out for is wheat. Because basically the only thing you're gonna need for this is, the only thing you're gonna need is um, a, you're gonna need just like a hoe with telekinesis and maybe like harvesting. Or maybe like turbo or turbo wheat or something on it and you're gonna need also a paid rank uh such as vip or whatever you just need vip because the what this gives you access to is the small hub selector within the hub selector in the skyblock hub which allows you to get into a small server with almost no one in the lobby uh and you're gonna want to just click around until you find servers with only you in them and then you're when the when the wheat contest starts you just want to go and clear out all the wheat as you can. You don't have to worry about every single piece because you just want to get the biggest amounts you can, get big chunks, then switch hub and to until you find one that there's one person in, and then repeat. And for the duration of the contest, which is 20 minutes. And then you should be able to get if you start right away, if you start like immediately and you have like um and, and, and you're and you're moving fast, then you should be able to get you could be able to get a silver, but it's more likely that you're gonna get a bronze, which is what I'm counting on for this video. So um, with a bronze, you would get a, a bronze medal, of course, and you would get 10 Jacob's tickets, which equal to 120,000 coins, which is quite a bit early game. If you're just starting off, that, that, that's a good amount of money. Um, I know it's not, it's, it's, it's like pocket change in a later game. This is why this is more of early or like early mid game tutorial for you guys. And also the money doesn't just come from the Jacob's tickets. It will also come from the item you're going to use to the or the item you're gonna buy using those Jacob's tickets, plus a gold medal in the end. Because for um, you won't actually need to earn a gold medal. You just need to earn eight bronze medals. Because you can trade up your medals, and you will need eight bronze medals to trade to a gold. Because two you trade two bronze for silver, and you need four silver to trade to a gold. So you trade eight of bronze for four silver, and then that four silver for two for one gold. And yeah, and then you can use that to buy a math hoe blueprint, which is the item you're gonna be selling. Um, I talked about earlier. This is the same kind of thing as the Matho Blueprint tutorial, but you can now sell. You can, you can sell Math Blueprint, uh, Matho Blueprints for about a million coins. I'd say that, that's what I see them going for about or 950k or so. That's what you see them going for. And plus, 
now after the new skyblock update where w it w involving player drops you can actually trade jacob's items like within the, within the trade menu so you can actually trade the math hub blueprint which is great which is awesome because it used to be a common method of scamming i believe because i tried to sell like a nether ward pouch once which is i don't know if that's a jacob's item but it's like a farming item and um i didn't know you can trade them and someone's like coming to my item with like scam and i'm like wait i'm just really confused and i found out that's actually a method of scamming people so you can't be that, that that's that's not a thing anymore luckily because you can actually trade the jacob's items i don't know why you weren't able to trade them in the first place it doesn't really make much sense but you can trade the as i'm getting off track you can trade the math hill blueprint for a mill and that's a mill is a lot of money early game that's a lot of money it's really good because you can get some fairly some fairly decent early game armor with that money and you can keep doing this in like if you're like a little short on money there's so many better ways to make money in like late game but you can do it if you want. It's not very efficient, but it it sure as hell works. I'll say that. And that's I'd say that's about it for this video. So, like I, like I said before, uh, you can use your money. Um, you can use the, um, or sorry, you, you can use those tickets and you can save about half a stack with a gold medal to trade up for a metho blueprint and sell that for a mill and sell all your leftovers for like another extra like 500k if you just repeat this process you should be able to knock the, get like millions in like a few days or like at least a few million it's really not that hard it's 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 it's, it's a pretty simple uh, thing actually i'm not sure if a lot of people do this uh, with with this specific math uh, w w with the specific uh matho blueprint and the wheat in the hubs with early game but i know a lot of people when it gets to late game farming becomes a massive component and people will make massive farms that's why i'm working on a massive sugarcane farm on my island right now because i'm gonna do uh jacob's contest and also level my farming skill but that's not that's not what this is about that's just about making some easy money early game so i hope you enjoyed this uh, quick guide if you got any if you got any like complaints about this i know this isn't probably the most efficient thing to do but i figure it's it's a, it's a pretty easy thing to do and i wish i'd known about this early game because i would have done this i would definitely would have done this early game and if you got anything you'd, you'd like me to do, like um, any videos you'd like to see me make, any tips on anything, then please let me know down in the comments. And thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one.